All right, what is up, everybody? We're getting right back into it, right back into the whiteout challenge. All right, so here we are, the Hibernia processing. Let's get to it. I think it's about time we drink some stuff. All right, and it looks like we're good. So today, I think we're gonna finish off this area, and then we will head back to the gas station. Well, I enjoyed my time here. I think it was well spent, and we got some good stuff. Could have been better. Could have gotten that. Sweet, sweet hatchet. Oh, what's that? Ooh, more rifle ammunition. Another five rounds? Are you joking? That means that is an insane amount of rifle ammunition right now. <laughs> um, there's nothing really in that direction. Like, it's not worth my time. I think there are better things we could be doing, so I'm going to just not. <laughs> kind of crazy that so far I've only seen one wolf, and that was like, I didn't even see him. It's kind of, it's kind of weird. I don't know... I was expecting this place to just be a nightmare, that's what I was told, and it's kind of just like, meh. <laughs> I've said that, and I'm told they're going to get ambushed by wolves now, walking back. Ooh, what is that? I just barely realized that there's a car right there. Matt's truck. Oh. Uh, hey Matt. Uh, pry bar. Dang it, I don't want a pry bar. He didn't have anything. Alright, sorry Matt. That's, uh, that's a shame. Looks pretty desiccated. Yep. <laughs> no thanks. I'm good. Alright, and that's it for over there. Alright, so we have Matt and a dead deer. Poor Matt. Rip in peace, friend, with your pry bar. <laughs> Rip in peace. Alright, so just from the looks of it, it looks like we actually have to go... I mean, these mountain, these cliffs look really sheer, so I'm guessing we have to actually go up and cross the bridges to get over to the lighthouse. Oh, there's a wolf right there. Oh, you're joking. You're coming for me, pal? Really? You want to go? Get away from me. Dang it. You're joking. Man, he's aggressive. Why is he coming for me? Mm, he's going to be right here, isn't he? Dang it. Screw you. Don't you cross that flare. Don't you cross that flare. Oh, frick. Oh, you're joking. Dang it! You sack of crap. Alright, well, that sucks. Oh, I'm coming for you. I'm coming for you, pal. Get over here. I couldn't get the other flare quite off. He's bleeding. Oh, man, he's he's just taking off. Dang it! Alright, what got, what got wrecked? Um, I guess just some of my clothes got a little... Tanked. Dang it, that sucks. It wasn't too bad. We lost a little bit of health, but that's, you know, not bad. I'm definitely going to be repairing a bunch of my clothes now, but dang it. That's the first time we've gotten attacked. I think it's because he saw me way across the ice, and so he just beelined it for me. Because he was only on me for like a second, so he didn't do too much damage to my clothes in the end. But we definitely survived our first wolf attack. Just glad it wasn't a bear. <laughs> Where is he? Can I see him from here? Uh, it doesn't look like it. Dang it, I hate him. <laughs> He, like, was super aggressive, though. I thought I could outrun him, but, like, he was strangely aggressive with me. Now, if I had a rifle, I would chase after that suck. A rifle clean kit, we already have a bunch of those. Firewood is fantastic. A book, we're probably going to drop a bunch of books. So, yeah, definitely next time we have a blizzard, we're just going to be sitting in our house and we're going to... Oh, I should actually probably check. Did I get injured at all? Oh, I have a sprained wrist. Okay, see, that's that's not bad. All right, not a big deal, it's just annoying. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how he could have avoided that, honestly, because he, like, came right for me. <laughs> he was not having any of that. Ooh, lantern fuel. I think maybe we'll be done with lantern fuel, possibly. Ooh, cup of herbal tea. <laughs> Let's drink it, why not? Scrap metal. I'm almost tempted to make a hatchet out of scrap metal, but I don't know if that counts. We have another flare, I guess we'll take that as a replacement. Simple tools. Ooh, I forgot to look this up, so I'm going to do a quick wiki search just to see... Holy crap! That is a good find. That is a really good find. That is going to be fantastic. We are going to... Nice. Okay, so simple tools are useful. They, use... they make it so that when you, uh, when you're crafting or repairing, it makes it actually go quicker. So that's actually really useful. Ooh, a cherry can. I guess that counts as lant as oil fuel. Decent cargo pants, really? And a worn military coat. Okay. And another MRE. This place is insane. I'm getting really heavy, but like it's insane. 
Holy crap. That is so much better. And it's only at 69%. I mean, this one's a little beat up too, but nice. Let's wear that. You served us well, Mackinac Coat, for about the 0.5 seconds that we had you. But man, those MRAs are going to push us really far into having enough calories to complete this challenge. Another five... What on earth? We have so many... We have so many... <laughs> I'm glad I checked behind this pallet. I probably wouldn't have seen that, uh, that jerry can otherwise. That's probably overkill for how much actual... Oh, another rifle cartridge. For how much lantern fill we need. I don't even know if it will be worth it. But that's fine, we can just take it. Looks like we got a good vantage point from up here, that's nice. Another rifle cartridge. How many do we have at this point? That's ridiculous. We have 24. We've tripled the amount of rifle cartridges we have. Oh, somebody died. Kind of want to take his body, to be honest. He caused me a lot of pain. That's a really good vantage point from up here, though. Uh, I think I want to go investigate over in that area. There might be some stuff. Um, it's a shame there's not a hatchet here. I was really, I was really kind of hoping, but, you know, it's fine. I need all that reclaimed wood. We just want to, you know, we're well fed right now, but I want to keep it that way. All right, well, I guess we will say goodbye to the lighthouse it was fun being in here oh it's about noon so we do want to go a little quicker and you know what i'm not gonna go after that wolf it's fine whatever he's dead i think that's punishment enough we'll not loot his corpse it's fine um and we'll just move on because we don't have a ton of time and it looks like it could start to snow i almost wonder if that was a wolf that was tracking me earlier because i do think that they do that occasionally where they'll actually track you and hunt you um and he might have been the one by the car and he was mad that i uh eluded him <laughs> well look who's dead now all right i'm gonna use for the first time ever i'm gonna open the trunk here using the pry bar the pry bar honestly is like not bad you can use it for a lot of stuff it's just kind of heavy worn ski gloves Ooh, i'll have to take a look at those um no it looks like they're a lot worse than the gauntlet so yeah we're approaching the entrance to desolation point uh there's one last place i'd like to check i think we actually oh is that to the mine? Yeah, I think that's just to the mine up there. We could check out the mine, but I don't think it'll have anything. Something is moving around and I don't like it. I don't know if it's that little rabbit right there or if it's a bear. It sounds slow and it sounds heavy. <laughs> I thought it was me, but I don't think it is. Okay, the area I actually want to investigate is... Oh, it was a deer. Okay, that's, that's what was moving around. I was like, what the heck? Hey, Mr. Deer. Hi, Mr. Rabbit. <laughs> yeah, here we are. Katie's secluded corner. It's a rabbit right there. A bunch of... Oh, there's a bow! Can't be too Holy! Good. Oh, man, there's so much stuff. Let's search this backpack and see what we got. Nothing. I don't know why it's called Katie's secluded corner. I can let the deer's named Katie. <laughs> I think we should be good for firewood now, but we are really heavy. I would think I would honestly rather use the rifle at this point because of how many cartridges we have. Like, we have a silly amount of cartridges. I guess we'll try and scale down like this. Don't know how this is going to go. Okay, and there's there shouldn't be anything over there. I think it's time to just go back. It's getting kind of late. It's noon right now. It's going to take a little bit to get back through the mine and also crumbling highway. Which means now I'm going to have to start thinking about my next move after this. Because I really need a hatchet. And it's really sucky that we haven't found one yet, because we've explored a ton of places, and it's just, I don't know how it happened. But apparently, the wolves aren't supposed to actually cross over flares, but that one was just, he didn't care. I tried to break line of sight with him as well, so that I could just get away, and he was not having it. But yeah, I actually really enjoyed that area. It was pretty small, so it wasn't like a lot of walking. Um, we didn't explore all of it, but I think we explored all the essential areas. Uh, but it was just, you know, it's just kind of fun. We have 50 matches. Okay, cool. All right, and we are out. We're going to hope that we just don't run into any wolves on our way back. That's that's the plan. I've had a, I've had one run in today. I don't want another. Yeah, my guy's getting pretty tired. Let's make sure we didn't leave anything in here. This guy had anything? Nope, sure is not. Yeah, the wind is not helping. It is making it a serious pain to walk. Let's get some elevation, see if we can just skirt around the wolves. Oh, you know, what is that? Yo, can we go down here? Oh my gosh, we can. Uh, another flare. Cured leather. More simple tools, newsprint, yada yada yada.
but I was literally looking inside this and I thought, this is a toolbox. This could have a hatchet. Holy crap. This is the best outing that we have ever had in this game. We've gotten so much stuff from this one time we left. That is insane. Take that sucker. I didn't even, I wasn't even planning on going to this place. I didn't know this place existed. I was just kind of bumbling about like, oh yeah, let's try and avoid the wolves. Freaking hatchet. Are you joking? Like, I, I don't want to seem like I'm making like a fake reaction to this. I'm honestly surprised. We have not been able to find a hatchet and it's been the worst thing. That is so nice. Like, seriously, I can't stress that enough. That is freaking awesome. I don't think we honestly need to leave Coastal Highway anymore. I think we're good to stay in Coastal Highway. Because I don't see why we would need to leave. We basically have everything. Like, the challenge is almost over. I don't think we're going to need to leave Coastal Highway anymore. I think we just need to kill a few animals, store their meat, and we'll be done. I was... I like legitimately did not know that place was there. And I did And when I went in, I wasn't expecting to find anything. So that is incredibly lucky. Uh-oh, it's starting to snow. So we have one last stretch until we get to the house, and then we will be good. The next day will probably be it, because we're just going to go hunting. We're just going to hunt a whole bunch of, like, deer, and that'll be it. I think it's hilarious that the hatchet is what we couldn't find. Like, that's something you should find pretty early game, and we just haven't. It hasn't been around. Probably likely that we'll have a blizzard tomorrow, and then the next day, no, and then the day after that, pretty much guaranteed again. Let's try and finish it in two days. I was planning on finishing by the 12th, and I think we're going to be able to be finished by the 10th, maybe even earlier. It depends, because we also have MREs, so we, for all I know, we could be, like, done. We could be done. Look at that deer right there. We have seen him several times, and I want to kill him. I want to shoot him with a rifle, take all of his meat, and be done. <laughs> Seriously, I've been keeping my eyes open for that hatchet for so long, and, like, getting ready to find it, and I haven't been able to. And so now I feel just like, I feel like kind of that purpose is gone of, it's kind of nice. It's making, we might even be done for firewood, for all I know. We have a lot of firewood with us. We just have a lot of stuff on us. Now, the only thing I have to do for today is not get mauled by a wolf, a bear, or a moose. <laughs> yeah, the wind is really picking up. I wonder if this is a Category 1 blizzard. If it is... I'm not losing any heat, so apparently I can just go out in blizzards and it's just fine. Oh, I see one right there. <laughs> and he's looking to make an interception course. I might have to crouch around him. What are you doing? Okay, I'm going out on the ice. We're just not going to worry about him. I don't know why he's going onto the... Is he just going back and forth? What on earth are you doing? I think he's going back out onto the ice. I mean, I'm not in a rush. I have all day. We're not doing anything else today. Like, we're done. Yeah, that was weird. He came back onto the road and I was like, eh, it doesn't look like there's anything over there. Let's just, let's just bail. Like, okay. Oh my gosh, I hear so many of them. They know I have the hatchet. They know that I'm basically done. Now I just need to get past those two wolves that always surround my house and then we will be good. Also, I think it would be super hilarious if I just found, like, a hatchet super close by, like, in an abandoned house or something. I think I might see them out there. Definitely hear them all around me. <laughs> Don't mind me, wolves. I could also take... I just realized I've carried the pry bar with me the entire time. Oh! We are back. Holy crap. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm going to unload all my crap, and then we're going to call it here for this episode, because holy crap. All right, we got our bow and our couple of arrows that we probably won't end up using. Another pry bar, simple tools. <sighs> A beautiful hatchet. Look at it. It's glorious. Look at this, 25 rifle ammunition. We have 37 bullets. <laughs> That's ridiculous. Oh, and a whetstone. I, I totally even forgot about that. Like, oh my gosh, we are basically done. <laughs> it's fantastic. Oh, look at this. We're going to put in some more of our some more of our fuel. We are 100% done with lamp oil. 8.4 days of food. Let's dump all this food and see where we're at. We are up to 11 days of food. From that one trip, we just got three days of food. And if we were to get... Oh, and look, we're one hardwood softwood away. So we're just going to take the hatchet out. We're going to break one tree and we're going to 
we're going to be done. If we just make water all day long, we'll be done with water. We just need to get one more hardwood softwood, easy now with a hatchet. And then we need four days of food. Like, that is how close we are. I only, I only foresee us having one, maybe two more episodes of this. Maybe. And, like, it's still pretty early. Like, we could do a fire or two. I don't know how you could take more than two weeks for this, honestly. Like, I guess maybe if you... I guess maybe if you got really unlucky or were super cautious and never left your house. I don't know. I mean, we did get pretty lucky with these two. I don't know if we actually had any blizzards on these two days. I think we for sure had one today, because that's a pretty okay blizzard. And I don't know if we got lucky with fines. I have no idea, but it just seems like I don't foresee us going past day 10. I think we're going to be done. <laughs> so if we get really lucky tomorrow and we don't have a blizzard tomorrow, we're done tomorrow. Like, there's nothing else we can do. We're just going to be done. All right, so we got some water there cooking. Uh, we're just gonna, I guess, repair our clothes. I, look at this. It's gonna take an hour and 30 minutes to repair this coat by 30%, which will put at new condition, but, like, that's gonna take a long time. Ah, oh, and it failed. Holy crap, it failed twice. We just wasted, like, an hour doing that. Well, I guess we're not doing the military coat. That kind of sucks. We just wasted four cloth, but whatever. All right, we just got another gallon of water, which means we're even closer to being done. All right. Oh, we just ruined our sewing kit, but that's okay. We have two more. So we're doing really well for warmth bonus. We're going to drink a whole bunch of sodas, and then we're going to go to bed, because that's a good idea, right? You know, it's just barely occurred to me that it actually doesn't count any of our sodas. Like, none of these sodas actually count towards our goal. I wish I had realized that earlier. So basically, we can just drink soda from now on. I mean, I think these count as calories still, but again, that's fine. We just need to eat more calories. So we won't drink our water anymore. We'll just drink straight soda, which I think that'll be fine. <laughs> Anyways, we're going to go to sleep. Ten hours. All right, and it looks like it's about dawn. We're going to need to drink and eat again, but whatever. So as long as we don't reach the starving zone, we, we will always have an extra 11. That's pretty good. I don't hear a blizzard, so I think we're good. And that will do it for day eight of this challenge, which, holy crap, this has been an insane episode. I don't even know what I'm going to title it. We were attacked by a wolf, finally found the hatchet. We're basically done. <laughs> like, we have, I think I'm going to have one more episode. I might make it a slightly longer episode as the finale, but, like, we're pretty much done. But, yeah, that's about it. I hope you guys are enjoying this series. If you are, make sure to leave a like, leave a comment. I appreciate all of you so much. Uh, make sure to check out the Discord down in the link below. We are having a bunch of people join. It's fantastic. We have memes, and it's great times, and it's a fun community, and I'm glad to have all of you that have joined. And make sure to share the series with your friends, and I will see you in the next episode for the finale. So, peace.